Ah, uh, good morning, lads. How are you doing? Hope you're doing well. Wenek, yeah, soon starting. Soon starting really, really early, man. How are you all doing? Hope you're all doing fine. So yesterday, yesterday was a bad day. <laughs> a bad day for me playing this game because, oh man, I messed up. I'm really messed up. Also, I should change that font because it looks hideous. I was checking that, like on the other window, and I was like, oh dude. Ah, oh, that looks so bad. Um, a boot day. It's a boot day? What kind of boots will you be wearing then? Oh, anyways, let's see. All of that is just going into. That's good. Okay, so I'm, I'm ready, set, able to go. Now, there are a few things that I would like to get... 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 <laughs> Get uh, get started on today, and that is we do we actually need to help in this war? I think he he doesn't. He still has the majority of his troops. Mm, I can only unlock big brain. Yeah, I know. Just just get me to fifteen subs, and I will get the second one in there. I'm sorry, there's there's little I can do um, about that. I, I wish I could do something about that. Um, for now, I've been thinking about this. Uh, I'm going to try if we can land troops over here. If we can actually block off troops here. But, um, let's see. Do you have a fortress in here? A shipyard and a regional camp and a shipyard. So, I should be able to block this off. So, <laughs> yeah. Also, yeah, Scotland still high on the list. Countries that we should actually. Are you still getting? Ooh, now Sweden would join France. No more. I think I have another another idea here. We have a claim here on Scotland. Um, we're going to be taking some of that terrain of him because, well, he really, really hurt me, and I did not like that one bit. So, we do have enough uh, light ships. So, that would be nice. So, let's get these two, like, over here. And when they're there, we're going to be transporting the troops. We're going to be stopping the drilling on these both. So, they can actually start building up some morale again. Uh, we still need to be somewhat careful with our manpower. But that will be fine. We'll just have to wipe the floor with him. Just siege him down. You know, the basics. <laughs> uh, we'll just see. Uh, we got one guy re returning. We're improving with Brabant. So what I'm hoping for is that we eventually can say against you. Like go to war for me. But apparently that is not a thing with him. So we'll just have to declare war ourselves. Now the reason why I would like to have him declare war is he is still part of the HRE. And I am not. Now Austria does have a truce with me. and But if I declare war on him, Austria would still join. They would probably not win because we're right now we're just overwhelmingly strong against him. And getting another vassal in here or just force feeding this to Brabant would even be better um i have to think about it we only have four out of four relation slots we st i still don't know what to do with all of our monarch points but uh, we'll figure it out where are you be going hmm. why yeah I, I know right wipe them out <coughs> we'll do it we'll do it also we need to keep building buildings um, barracks would also be nice. We need to go with manufacturing because those are almost done. Uh, four more. Four more and we'll get some more. But we're making so much money. It's incredibly insane how to do all of this. So with all of that, let's go to speed three for a second. So I can see what the hell I'm going to be doing. We should just try to... Oh man, this is so ugly. Let's go. Covert actions, build up spy network. Let's build that up a tiny bit more. We're not there yet, and if we can get another claim, then that would be nice. Uh, costly trade embargo, because Poland no longer is a valid rival. So, yeah, that's interesting. That really is interesting. There's, there's little I can do to go to war with him, because there's no cause for it. 
Let us go with economic actions and revoke the embargo. And we'll have to select a new rival. But we're still in that, in that one war. Uh, which we're of course not going to do anything about. Because I'll let the Ottomans deal with it. They're strong enough, right? <laughs> ah, this is so annoying. So how is actually the coring over here? The Memlocks are here. <laughs> really, the Memlocks. Interesting. Oh, and that's almost cored out completely. So we'll eventually... No, Liberty Desire is still very, very good. I'll keep them on aggressive so they will attack troops that are in land. I'm expecting his troops to go here. I guess not. I guess not. Um, friends can... Look at the size of this. That's nice. I would really, really like that. Do we have claims upon you? So if we let the new Amsterdam's go to war. Or the new Netherlands. I don't want to declare war on, on those. So we'll have to do it like this of course. I'm a dum dum. Start colonial war. New Netherlands is at war. Yeah, okay, because we're already at war. Let's take a look into paying off debt. You keep making debt here. I do not like that. Hmm. Yeah, it's fine like this. So let's go back to Scotland. I'll take things a bit slower today because I've been going way too fast. What the hell is this? Redeem my, my gimme bling bling highlighted message by when heck? Anticlimactic. I know, right? It is anticlimactic. You should save up points and do something useful with them. So let's get these troops and let's get started with you over there. And I should have stopped drilling with you. Do I need to... Let's take a look. So, Scotland. Scotland has not enough troops. And Sweden and Lithuania. Maybe we do not want to split up. Because Sweden will get into the war. Mm. Is there something I can do with you? Can I build up claims against you? Let's take a look. I was kind of hoping that we can... This might be one. No. That's a bloody shame. I was kind of hoping that I would be able to um, get a crossing over there. But apparently that is not the case. Sweden has claims upon me. That's why they want to join. What we of course can do is just block them off. And I think their entire navy, by the looks of it, is in this strait over here. So, yeah, we, we want to block this off. So, we'll get over here. Although, I don't think I can block them off getting into their own territory. So, we can try it over here so it'll be stuck over there. Which is fine for us. We don't care. Uh, you definitely need to stop drilling. That is good. Because we're going to be knocking out... Where's Lithuania? Oh, they got a nice island over there. Which we, of course, are going to be taking. Because I do not want Scotland to have colonial regions at all. Okay, let's uh, let's declare. I know about that spy network. Yeah. Taking Derby. They would join. Lithuanian order is to the side. Sweden, of course, not the Ottomans. I, I would, I would, but you are going to be called in with your ally and the Ottomans and Osnabrück are already at war. So, I want to get to this castle first, in all honesty, because I think it is too much for not doing that. There's some ships over here. Do we have others? So, they're actually in the... In port. Did I not? Oh, it's, <laughs> it's the transports. These guys are all the way in here. They got a nice amount of heavies. Apparently, I lost one. 
I cannot say I'm happy about that. Siri, wait a minute. You're not doing anything. That is sitting there. <laughs> I've been really mad. Um, let's see, 500 points away for a push-up. That's actually, it's... Um, I think it's 10. I think it's 10. At least it says it's 10 push-ups with me. Uh, I will do so. I, I don't mind push-ups. I'm still doing them regularly, so... <laughs> keep the push-ups coming. <clears throat> hmm. <sighs> so, the 15k troops, they will get in here. What we can do is we can simply just log them in. Don't really need to. And the seed should be going relatively soon. But it looks... No, actually, they still have the 2k troops out there. No problem. We're just gonna make them pay. So who else am I now at war with? So the Lithuanian order is all the way over there. Kinda don't feel the need to get all of that. Yeah, I don't think they can cross. <clears throat> I don't think they can... We can cross. Can we get into Denmark? Only if we use our transports. I don't mind fighting um, Sweden. We just have to make sure that we actually get a... A fortress going. That would be so nice. Like getting this could make me claims over here. Hmm. Yeah, they're going to be carpeting this. Uh, what I will do is I will get troops in here. <laughs> Just sitting over here. Get all of the castles, get all of the forts, get over here, annihilate the army. We don't have to pay attention to the army, actually. That's what I've been told. We can invest in a trade company. Actually, I will. There is a building, and it's this one. Um, let's see. Mm, so we need this. Oh, you can only have one. Okay. Okay, then we don't need this. Local tax modifier is not that interesting. How's the cape? Steering goods is just the best for this one. How about the other one? Uh, we got one over here as well. The game keeps forgetting. Did I not make this into a trade company? I don't mind, actually. So, uh, what I'm trying... What I'm hoping that we can do is just grow this. So, we're going to war with these fellas as well. Just making sure that we got a good, good, strong foothold in that. Eventually, Spain, we also need to deal with. Okay, so I cannot walk through there. So I might as well just bring both of my armies over here. If, if they can't do anything over there, I might as well just bring them. And this is way too many trips on this uh, tiny-ass fortress. So let's split. Not in half. We're going to be detaching for siege. Go towards the next one. Negative 42 apparently. Uh, we gain a stability. I would really welcome that. And same guys for you. You go sit on top of that. And uh, we're going to be dealing with this. Okay, so split. Uh, let, okay, so that's D. Uh, I want you to go towards... You know what? Just, just go have some fun over here. The 10k. You go there. You go here. And um, we'll do the same with you. Detach for siege. And then split. Okay, we cannot go there. 
There's also a uh, fortress over there, actually. Let me go send you there. <clears throat> what you can... I can do as well. We have to be careful of these guys because they might be attacking. That would be somewhat annoying. And we'll just send these guys over there and just group up again. Uh, until these fortresses fall. Okay, you. Let's go back over there. You go back over there. Just to make you a bit stronger. I don't want to sp get into a position where my army is just weird. Now you, we can actually let you go over there. And then you... Go there. Do we see enemy troops over here? No. And... Wow, Brabant actually has... A good amount of troops here. Um, I think we will win this. Nice. I'm hoping you will um, have a lot of your troops. On the bottom of the sea. Because we do not care about that. So you. Are also part of this one. Actually you go there. No oh, that, that ain't good. <laughs> well it's fine. I don't care about that. Let's go. Get all of the troops together again. And we take Scotland. We'll make it a bit tinier. A bit. We'll have to do this in several goes because I don't think... Well, actually, France has no longer an alliance with these guys, so that's interesting. So that's going to be a rather large stack coming our way. This fortress is now ours, so we can actually have that fight over here. Can this fortress please fall? Dude, seriously? Um, this fort needs to fall. Okay, so we might as well just keep you over here. Let's give... No, we don't need to give them a hand. We'll just go back, we'll regroup these guys. Actually, just take this. If you're going to be here as well, we might as well, right? And we'll deal with those troops on one of the fortresses that is in here. I'm actually thinking that I should actually get some of these icons that's be uh, behind my, uh, my webcam changed. So I can actually see what the hell is going on here. So they are getting on this fortress. This is now my fortress. So, we'll have that fight. Let's go over there. Whoa, they unseached that? Oh, what a move. Oh, I don't think that is fair. I don't think that's fair. You go over there. We'll take all of that back. We can make estates. Hmm, or we can make states, not estates, but states. So, slowly... No, we'll wait until they leave. Let's go right onto the capital right now. It's their fortress, so we'll have to be somewhat careful. I don't think they will attack anytime soon. We should also take all of this back. Go over there. Let's take a look what kind of uh, options that we actually have. Uh, Institute, I've not been using. So let's clear that one up. Let's clear it up. Uh, 
Colonial ranges, nice. Political. We have something that is uh, yeah, terrain. We can actually add a few in terrain. Like go with fortresses. So, okay. So, yeah. This is the final fortress they own. Um, the same goes with Greenland. Yeah, looks good. Looks good. Yeah, let's continue. Um, that's going to fall anytime soon. They're just waiting there. They don't need to fight me. They don't want to fight me. We'll take this. We'll go here. We'll free all of this up and we go back. Let's speed up a tiny bit more because this is just going to take some time. Quarantine them. Let's go send you over there. And we'll split all of this up. And we'll just wait over here since we do have that, uh, that fortress. Uh, lose the stability or lose Diplo. I'll lose the Diplo for now. Yeah, we're still 13 years ahead of time. So, yeah, we don't really need to pay attention to that. Hmm. Is there a way for us? What kind of idea would we go on next? This actually isn't that bad. Siege ability is very nice. Force limit, discipline, army morale. <sighs> we'll have to see about this. Can you move? Thank you. Hey, you might lock me in here, but that's fine. So, right now, let's see. Let's go. One, two, three. 5k, 6k. Okay. This is going there. Okay, the siege is over, but we will remain over there. You go there. And uh, we can actually get all of these troops back. I think this is the uh, the final three. Go over there. We'll keep one over there. Let's deal with this. I don't need any rebels taking any fortresses back. And send you back over there. Uh, the navy is a bit annoying. Uh, we can deal with that. We can deal with that. But we're, we're kind of still blocking off uh, Sweden. It is at negative 51. How about the Lithuanian order? 37. Yeah, we'll deal with you shortly. When we actually have control over Scotland and Iceland. Don't need any troops being built over there. Actually, you know what? Let's go deal with this. Let's go deal with their navy. We still have our vessel over here. And there we go. That's going to be the navy. We captured a ship. Let's go over there. Take care of this so we can actually make a crossing. We need to invest again our points. 
Uh, we need to do something with this because our power projection is really low. I don't like that. And we should actually be building these buildings and increasing production as well. Almost everywhere. It, it is time that we get started on this. Let's go. Everlasting friendship. And we got Willem, who is a 2 2 1. I cannot say I'm too uh, too thrilled by that, but it is what it is. Do you have any transports in you? I need to remember to take those out. Let's go over there. And now we will hunt. So I'm expecting Swedish troops to get into my territory. Let's go after these guys. 23 ships. Uh, get a base tax, we'll lose some admin. Which is good, since I was already over it. Uh, we're making 136 right now, which is good. Their troops, they're just waiting here. So where is that bloody fleet of theirs? And there's two heavies over there. So let's deal with that. And uh, once again, we can afford, let's do some more production. Oh, we, we have such a long list. Of buildings being constructed. And there's almost nothing I can do with my money anymore. And we'll send one stack over to the, towards the other side. The other one is going to deal with the Lu uh, Lufuanian order. I think we'll send the smallest stack over to uh, Iceland. And look at that, the landing troops. They are landing their wonderful stacks. I think my vessel can deal with that. What we should do is just land troops over here. And knock out Sweden. There we go. That's all of those buildings. can just let them sit over there there we go that's all ours we're going to be sending you to Iceland and you yeah well, we need them over here so the supply limit is 45 this army is let's see yeah 45 I will accept that. We'll have to deal with this. Uh, however annoying it is, we'll have to deal with it. I'll send you over there. Hopefully they will get off their island. So my troops are going over there. Hmm, do they still have a navy? Nah, uh, there's some ships. There are some ships. And yeah, the Ottomans... You should piece these guys out. The Memlux, Arjun. The Ottomans are really dangerous. My participation has not been high in this war. Uh, but we don't have to care about that, right? I don't think they will get out of this situation. I'll be honest with that. So, we're once again high on admin. Let's get some... Uh... There you go. So that is now under our control. I kind of don't want to make the crossing. <laughs> I'll be very honest. I'll be very honest with you. Let's just get back towards the capital. See if they will start moving. And they cannot move. That is the biggest problem. Let's go help out over there. And there's uh, some transports. The Ottomans have uh, seized any uh, aggressions. We get... One. Okay, that's fine because we did not do anything. Uh, we are going to be using all of these favors against... France, hopefully. Uh, because I want the coastline. I've decided that we should be building up spy network with France. 